new warship and the aircraft carrier. The SU-57M will be added to modern warships and it will be abandoned. All you need to know about the April Fool's event and also the Seas of Prey event will be back. The price of the new Russian drone. Stay until the end because I bring you a lot of leaks in this video. Let's start with this leak, because we will have a third season of the Seas of Prey event. And with this banner we have leaks of the new avatars and the new warships that we will have with this event. Ok, so you need to keep in mind that the Seas of Prey event and the April Fools event are totally different, ok? So that means that we will have two events in this month. So, look at that, we have a warship and an aircraft carrier. So, the warship is the ROX KDDXS Destroyer. And most likely, this will be the gacha or lottery rewards. And the aircraft carrier, which is a drone carrier, is the Ghost Commander. Okay, so both are Korean warships, since it seems like this battle pass and the season was all about Korea. About this drone carrier, it seems like this will be the bundle of this event, ok? So remember that you need to complete some stages and at the final stage you will get a 90% discount of this warship or drone carrier. But in that picture we can see some strike fighters, which means that it could be equipped with drones, helicopters and the strike fighters as well. About the free reward of this event, we don't have leaks yet, but some rumors, I mean, this is nothing official, says that the free reward could be a Korean strike fighter. Also, we have leaks of the new April Fool's event. And I want to give special thanks and the credits to Joseph Modern Warships for this clip. And not only for this clip, but for a lot of leaks of this video that he always shared with the Modern Warships community. Also, I recommend you to subscribe to 60TP Gaming. He creates incredible movies about Modern Warships. Ok guys, this is the new April Fool's event. It will be a racing mode, but it is nothing normal or something that you have ever seen in the game before, because this time you will be able to control the oil tankers and you will have to compete against enemies and also you will have to crash them through the way. There will be consumables that will help you to restore your health and also to push your enemies. Ok, so this is pretty cool. I don't know yet if we're gonna have some kind of rewards with uh, this new event, but apparently there was uh, some error in the game and uh, this mode was available for a few hours. Some players were able to test uh, these and also we have leaks of more modes that are coming to the game, ok, so we will have once again the Tandem Wars. Ok, so apparently this Tandem Wars has something to do with the new Seas of Prey event. While the racing mode will be the April Fool's event. So, this actually confirms that the Sky Carrier mode is not coming soon, because we don't have leaks about that mode. But, something that is coming to the game is the SU-57M Strike Fighter, ok? So remember that I told you that the devs were planning to add this new Strike Fighter to Modern Warfront and I told you that there was a probability that they could add this to Modern Warships as well. Well, it seems like it is actually happening because one of the moderators of the game already confirmed that we will have this strike fighter 
Inth also a new aircraft carrier with the new event, so... At first I thought that this new strike fighter could be a free reward and the aircraft carrier could be like the bundle of this new event. But apparently this could be a bundle, okay, so I'm talking about the new strike fighter because there are some leaks of a picture of these strike fighters and a price that is around 6,800 art coins. This is nothing confirmed, by the way, okay, so this could be an edit and this could be fake. Because to be honest, if this was a bundle, I think that uh, this price is too low. Taking into consideration all the prices that Artstorm uses for all of their items. So I want you to comment below, what do you guys uh, think about uh, this uh, new Strike Fighter? And if you would like to see this as a free reward uh, or as a bundle, remember that some players prefer these items as a bundle because they like to collect items. The truth is that this will arrive to the game, but we don't know yet if it will be a bundle or free, okay, so that's nothing official. In other leaks, I have the price of the new Sapsan Russian drone. Remember that I already told you that this was going to be a bundle? Well, it seems like one of the players and the moderators of the game, I'm not sure yet what is his role, he is Ramses, and he posts content in TikTok. So he posted a review about uh, this drone and also this picture of the bundle. The price of this uh, drone will be around uh, 7,700 uh, art coins, which is not uh, too expensive, but it is a drone, it is not a bomber or a strike fighter. So it is a reasonable price in my opinion, and it won't uh, be free, as I was expecting, because at some point I thought that uh, this could be the free reward of this new event. So, a lot of things could happen, because we already know that we're gonna have this drone, the aircraft carrier, and the new strike fighter, so I would like to know which will be the free reward of this new event. Guys, today we're gonna be using the best torpedoes of the game, because we have the Agja torpedo, we have the Type 89, the Mark 45 Astor nuclear torpedo, and the new Tiger Shark torpedo. Okay, so I'm not saying that uh, this is one of the best uh, torpedoes of the game, but since it is new, we're gonna test it along all of these good torpedoes. Okay, so this is one of my favorite submarines, by the way. This is the French FS SMX 31 submarine. And we're gonna try to destroy all the enemies with uh, this incredible build. So we should go this way, it seems like there are some strike fighters and an aircraft carrier over there. So yeah, let's go for that guy. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to win this battle only using the torpedoes, okay? So this will be my main goal. So let's go underwater right now. Yeah, let's go underwater, look at that damage. 161,000 points only using the torpedoes, guys. Like, that's a lot of damage. And look at that, bro, like, that warship is in the way. No way, bro, come on. Let's go back to the surface, because I don't want to run out of oxygen. So look at these, bye-bye, my friend. Okay, so that was perfect, I'm gonna use uh, some torpedo decoys. Perfect, okay, so let's go this way. We have, okay, we have another submarine over there. Woo, it's the same submarine that I have. <laughs> and we're going to destroy this guy. Look at this. Yes, we're gonna do it. Yo, he used the torpedo decoys, but we could destroy that guy with the Agja. We can do it. That's not a problem with this torpedo. Let me keep spamming. I need to use more torpedo decoys. I'm gonna use a repair kit. Okay, so we must be careful because we could crash and let's go underwater now because we have Massachusetts right there. Yeah, let's use more torpedoes, look at that, this is perfect, okay, look at that damage, that's the nuclear torpedo, and the other one was Akaja, I guess, 
So yeah, let's go back to the surface because I need uh, to get uh, a better position in order to fire all the torpedoes. Bye bye, my friend. Only with uh, torpedoes we're going to destroy that Massachusetts, and uh, we did it. Okay, so that was perfect. Okay, bro, this was so easy. We must uh, do it again. Okay, guys. So now we are in Arctic. But, bro, I don't know if it is my graphics configuration, but this feels like a different map, bro. I don't know why, but it feels totally different. Okay, so we're gonna do the same. We're gonna try to win this battle only using the torpedoes. Okay, so we have Argonas right there. So we must use a fast torpedo. Okay, so that's something that I don't know or something that I don't have very clear about which is the fastest uh, torpedo of all the torpedoes that we have equipped now. Okay, so there are two Argonas over there. <laughs> that's crazy. And look at that, we have Admiral Nakimov, so let's go underwater now. Should we try to destroy that Argonas? I'm gonna try to get closer. Yeah, we should destroy Argonas. And yeah, let's go for Nakimov. It's a better option. Only the torpedoes. Remember that we're gonna use only the torpedoes, so not the missiles. Okay, so let's go for Admiral Nakimov. Remember that he can't use uh, torpedo decoys, so this will be the perfect target. More torpedoes. Okay, but he can use his grenade launcher in order to destroy the torpedoes. So, yeah, he can do it. I use more. Look at this. Let me spam the Mark 45. Now, this Tiger Shark torpedo. And we're going to destroy you, my friend. We're gonna do it uh, this time. Okay, so let's keep going. Whoa, look at that, 41,000, and yeah, you're so dead, my friend. This will be our first elimination, only with uh, torpedoes. Okay, so let's go back to the surface. Bye-bye, my friend. It was my pleasure. Okay, so I need to be careful here. I don't want to crash. What is that? Bro, nobody is destroying that. Okay, so that's the scene type, uh, 094. And uh, look at that, there's the Argonas project. I must uh, use uh, some torpedo to the coins. Bro, there's no way they're going to destroy me. I need to go underwater, but right uh, now, bro. Like, this is so bad. Okay, so let's go for that aircraft carrier. Bro, like, I must uh, use uh, the missiles. I have to do it. They're going to destroy me. So yeah, let's continue this way. Maybe we're gonna be able to do it. Yeah, we're gonna do it. I believe in myself. Okay, my friend. Look at that, we're gonna spam torpedoes. Okay, so this would be better now. 72,000, okay. Yo, this is such a cool build, to be honest. Okay, so I need to use another repair kit. No way, I used uh, missiles. Bro, it was a mistake. And uh, bye bye, my friend. Only with uh, torpedoes once again. Okay, so I should get uh, some cover now, bro. Nobody's destroying the Argonas. What are you doing, my friend? Let's go back to the surface. Yes, there are two more enemies over there. And uh, there's the Argonas, bro. Like, that guy is trying to destroy me. He's gonna do it, bro. Okay, so I'm gonna use more torpedo decoys. And uh, yes, I'm gonna stay underwater for a while. Okay, so we have CN type 094 right up there. So I'm gonna use the Akita. Are you gonna use torpedo decoys? Please don't do it, my friend. Don't do it. Okay, so he's not gonna do it. Okay, so he did it. He did it at the end. But uh, now we can fire the rest of the torpedoes. Bye bye, my friend. This will be another elimination. We're gonna do it only with one torpedo, maybe? No way, another assist. Okay, so there's the Argonas project. Let me spam the torpedoes. Bro, like, that thing is so fast. So it will be really complicated to hit uh, that guy. Okay, so maybe we're gonna do it. No, bro, look at that. It is almost impossible. 
let me keep spamming with all the torpedoes. We're going to destroy that guy. Yes, we're going to do it. I'm going to use another repair kit. Now, he's over there. And yes, bye-bye, my friend. Okay, so we did it. Already more than 1 million damage. This is cool. Okay, so we have the CN type 058 over there. What is that guy doing? I need to use some flares. More torpedoes. Let's go underwater immediately. You're so dead, my friend. Okay, so to be honest, my favorite torpedo is the Mark 45. Okay, so even though it is affected uh, by the enemy flares, I don't know why I found it like my favorite. So <laughs> that's why. Look at that. Bye bye, my friend. Another elimination. And we win this battle only using uh, torpedoes, so this is cool. Look at that, four targets destroyed. 